Ladies and gentlemen, it's a huge honor to be sharing this day with you as Spirit of Adventure's godmother. In taking on this role for such a spectacular cruise ship, I'm not only proud as an individual, but I feel I'm representing all those healthcare professionals across the NHS and the armed forces who have supported this country's fight against COVID-19. I'd like to pay special tribute to the Royal Navy Medical Service and to the team who I was working with in Navy Command Headquarters here in Portsmouth, who have worked above and beyond during some very challenging times. 12 months ago, I lost a good friend and a colleague to cancer. I'd especially like to thank Saga for their very kind donation to Kidney Cancer UK in memory of Angela. Her husband, Neil, is currently head of the Naval Nursing Service. Of course, when I was invited to be the godmother, there was a mixed response from my family and friends and my colleagues. There were those who said, Saga, it's for the over 50s, surely not. Then there were those who offered, but 50 is the new 30, how exciting. I'm certainly the latter. And now it's time for me to create some new memories. This country has suffered a lot over the last 18 months. And despite not being out of this yet, people need to look forward to better times. Saga and the spirit of adventure is ready to offer people those long waited for holidays in safe and luxurious surroundings. And now, ladies and gentlemen, I name this ship Spirit of Adventure. May God bless her and all who sail in her. Gentlemen, please be standing for the national anthem. Oh! 